Welcome to a journey through the hidden crisis unfolding in our cities, the silent disappearance of urban green spaces. From bustling parks to serene community gardens, these green spaces once formed the lifeblood of urban life. However, rapid urban development has led to the encroachment and reduction of these vital areas, leaving us in concrete jungles. Recent studies reveal that over the past decade, urban green spaces have declined by an alarming rate. This loss profoundly impacts our mental health, reducing opportunities for relaxation and social interactions. Children, who benefit immensely from outdoor play, are particularly affected by this shrinking access to greenery. Moreover, urban green spaces play a critical role in environmental sustainability, influencing air quality and climate regulation. They act as urban cooling stations, mitigating the urban heat island effect. Without these natural sanctuaries, cities become more susceptible to extreme weather conditions, affecting all inhabitants. The disappearance of green spaces also leads to a decline in urban biodiversity, putting local flora and fauna at risk. As natural habitats decrease, so do the populations of birds, insects, and small mammals, further destabilizing urban ecosystems. Community bonds weaken without shared public spaces where people can freely gather and engage. On a socio-economic level, green spaces are increasingly replaced by profit-driven projects, prioritizing financial gain over public well-being. Yet, all hope is not lost. Solutions are emerging that marry urban development with green sustainability. One approach includes integrating green rooftops and vertical gardens in buildings, turning vacant spaces into verdant oases. Urban farming initiatives are gaining ground, bringing nature back into the heart of cities while promoting local food production. City planners and architects are also championing pocket parks, small but impactful green spaces scattered throughout urban areas. Another innovative solution lies in green corridors, which connect isolated green spaces to create a continuous natural path. Community involvement is paramount. Grassroots movements and local organizations are spearheading the reclamation of public green areas.
These efforts often involve transforming abandoned lots into community gardens, fostering a strong sense of ownership and stewardship. Experts suggest that greening our cities could also mean turning towards ancient wisdom and practices. Incorporating principles of feng shui, for instance, can harmonize the energy of urban spaces by strategically placing plants and water features. Moreover, spiritual practices like forest bathing, immersing oneself in a lush environment, can be tailored for urban settings. City parks can host guided meditation sessions, allowing residents to reconnect with nature and their inner selves. Simple mindful walking routines in green spaces can also enhance mental clarity and emotional balance. By merging scientific innovation with spiritual approaches, we can create cities that nourish both body and soul. Reimagining our urban landscapes is not just about aesthetics, it's a return to a balanced way of living. Ultimately, reclaiming urban green spaces is about recognizing their indispensable value and fostering a deeper connection to nature. Join us in this movement to revive our urban green spaces. It's time for a green renaissance in our cities. Thank you for watching.